Hello YouTubers and welcome to another Disney Pixar Cars diecast review and today we're gonna revisit the Rev and Go Racer now known as Wayne Dasher the veteran Rev and Go Piston Cup Racer number 73 from Cars 3. Now before we revisit and review, let me explain something. So, <clears throat> Wayne Dasher, or I originally call the Rev and Go Racer, Joshua Josh Leverson, is an Excelifish on EA Piston Cup Racer that was sponsored by Rev and Go and bore the number 73 and had recently replaced the previous Rev and Go racer, Misty Motorcrass. And during his diecast release, he was released once in the Desert Race 11 pack of 2017 along with Cars 3 Lightning McQueen. Rusty's Racing Center Lightning McQueen, Jackson Storm, Cal Weathers, Brick Yardley, Bobby Swift, Cars 3 Todd Marcus, Rev Meeker, Chick Hicks with a headset, and Tex Dynaco. And it was his only re one time release. And hasn't been released since, until until he would he would although although my original name for the Rev and Go Racer was Joshua Josh Lieberson, which he was only referred to as Rev and Go Racer on the Desert Race Eleven pack until this year in 2022 when on the 2022 Disney Cars poster, he he was give, Mattel given him a name, Wayne Dasher, and in the singles group, and there has been rumors that he is going to be named now named Wayne Dasher. So anyhow, in, during his appearance in Cars 3, he was one of the racers that attended the Dynaco Light 350 at the Motor Speedway of the South and the Dynaco 400 at Copper Canyon Speedway of 2016. And on that same year, he was one of the remaining veteran stock car racers to, to participate in the LA 500 at the Los Angeles International Speedway of 2016 and before the and then the following year in 2017 before the Florida 500 at Florida International Speedway he was then dismissed by his re, and replaced by his sponsor in favor of a next gen racer named M Fast Fawn who I unfortunately don't have so anyhow Without any further ado, let's dig right into the re-review. Here we've got his happy, joyful facial expression, his headlights and grill and number 73 at the bottom, his and on the hood we've got the Rev and Go logo and the orangish red on in the background and on the left side we've got the black rims on the light year black wall light year tires and number 73. Rev and Go logo, covered decongestant, the gas cap, and the the red arrow at the bottom indicating a pity to lift him up. The several contingencies he sponsor logo saying Piston Cup, Vitaline, Revolting, RPM, Nitrate, Octane Gain, and Clutch Aid. And on the top we've got another number 73 no name signature. And on the trunk we've got the Rev and Go logo. And on the back we've got the tail lights and the Rev and Go logo with the camera and on the back bumper we've got another no, a number 73 and on the right side 
we've got the exhaust pipes, similar in design but completely different. And that is it. Now, let's compare them to the other Rev and Go racer, Misty Motorcrafts. Here are some similarities and differences. Both race for Rev and Go, the carburetor decongestant and the piston cup, and bore the number 73, and both are painted blue. But here are some differences. This Misty Motocross is from Cars 1, while Wayne Dasher is from Cars 3. Misty is a Crown Celesta. Wayne is a Excello Fijon EA. Angry facial expression. Happy facial expression. 2005 Rev and Go logo. 2016 Rev and Go logo. Both don't bear any name signatures on the top, just the number 73 and the Rev and Go on the trunks. Both have the number 73 and the Rev and Go logo and the gas caps on the sides and arrow at the bottom, no arrow at the bottom. Exhaust pipe on the left, no exhaust pipe on the left. Blue rims, black rims. Several contingency sponsors saying Piston Cup, Nitrate, Revolting, Octane Gain, Mood Springs, Vitally, No Stall, Gaskets, Gas Sprint, Easy Idle, RPM, Little Torquey Pistons, Leak Less, Retread, and Clutch Aid. Lesser sponsors saying Piston Cup, Vitally, Revolting, RPM, Nitrate, Octane Gain, and Clutch Aid. Number 73 on the taillights. Number 73 on the back bumper. Carburetor decongestant on the back bumper. Carburetor decongestant on the back, the tailgate. And oh, I forgot to mention one thing. 73 on the headlights. 73 underneath the headlights. Exhaust pipe on both sides. Exhaust pipe on the right side. Older model, modern mo younger and modern law model. And that is all I can say. Now let's pull up some of the other Excello Fijon EA Piston Cup racers. We've got Brick Yardley, Parker Brakeston, Tommy Highbanks. Dud Throttleman, Brian Spark, Buck Barringley, and Terry Cargaz, even though he resembles Cal Weathers. And the other XL vehicles, we've got Mac Icar, who is a normal Fijon, Manny McGear, who is a Microlux and Cora Copper who is a Repetto SI and that is it now if you're wondering why the Revan now if you're wondering why I now if you're wondering ring if the Revan Go Racer is actually going to be named Wayne Dasher on the 2022 Disney Cars poster the links will be in the description down below or in the pop-up suggestions. But what do you guys think? Which Rev and Go racer is your favorite? Is it Misty Motocrass or Wayne Knight or as I formally know, name it, Joshua Josh Lieberson or Mfast Fawn, who I unfortunately don't have? Which XLO Fijon EA Piston Cup racer is your favorite? And which XLO vehicle is your favorite also? Let me know what you think, as well as leaving any suggestions in the comments down below. And if you have enjoyed this video, please don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. 
Also, consider the support by checking out my other videos on my channel, and feel free to make, su make any suggestions if you want to. And I hope to see you guys next time for another review, so please stay tuned. Goodbye now!